Hey, what's up you guys? I'm Yamik, and today we're going to be talking about a book called The Wish by Angela Donovan, as you can see. I got this from the library, so, and I have not returned it. <laughs> not good. Okay, so, this is from chapter 18 of the book, um, Intention is Everything. So I'm just going to let you see this real fast. And I will post this, you know, with the book, all the pages, as I edit, or when I edit. All right, so, let's go. Intention is everything. Your intention, my intention, a friend's intention, what is it? I remember my grandmother saying things like, he has such good intentions, he wasn't to know it, was going to backfire. Whatever our intentions, they still go astray. Unless, of course, we have a complete understanding of how to work with them towards a positive outcome. This is more easily achieved when you are calm, prepared and organized, and ready to direct the thought, command, fluidity through to its desired conclusion. <laughs> As the saying goes, it's not the deed, but the thought behind the deed. That was a mouthful and a handful. <laughs> During my courses, I regularly had to remind people to breathe when they're doing the thought intention exercises. They can get so tied up in their thoughts and in intentions, it's easy to forget to breathe. Breathe, people, breathe. <laughs> we always have to laugh about it, which is an incredible beneficial way of reducing any tension and bringing about even greater self-healing and further relaxation. Once you define your intention a few times, you will find it gets much easier to make and give commands to yourself. Now think about that one. So uh, I wasn't going to read this part, but I think it's really powerful, so I'm going to read it anyway. So here we go. Trust in your own evidence as everything starts slipping divinely into place. The crucial point is for you to recognize that you have the power to direct your own thought for positive intention, whether to benefit your health, to build your self-love, or, <laughs> or to create the perfect outcome for that date, appointment, or meeting, or whatever you need to do. Everything can be changed by thought and positive intention. How do you feel? What do you do? Who do you wish to be? Who you wish to meet next? All is made possible when you give yourself the moment to plan your thoughts and direct them positively. And to breathe. <laughs> and to breathe. Because I gotta, you know, tell myself to breathe, you know, even more so because I talk really fast. I have a thousand thoughts a minute. I always like to speak and talk and converse to people. So I have to breathe. 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 <laughs> well, I just want to end it with this particular um, passage from this chapter, from this chapter 18, from chapter 18 in the book, <laughs> Intention is Everything. Um, this is for people who feel like they're not at the space they're supposed to be in life. This is for people who feel like they're too far behind, they're too old. They feel like they have, they shouldn't be, or they shouldn't be where they're at, at their age or the space they're in their life. They feel like they should be more advanced. This is what I want you to know, and this is why I want you to... If you listen to anything else in this vlog, I want you to listen to this, okay? So time is purely a... Let me start over. And breathe. <laughs> time is purely a man-made concept that evolved to help us plan, understand where we're at, and survive. But it is not all there is. You need to start thinking in terms of living as if each day is the first day of your life. Let me read that again. You need to start living and thinking in terms of living as each... Living as it, I can't even say it. The, the message is so powerful, I can't even get it out. You need to start thinking in terms of living as if each day is the first day of your life. There you go, I got it out. <laughs> Breathe. <laughs> this is the only way you can then conceive a plan for all you wish for. Should I read that again? I think so. Time is purely a man-made concept that evolved to help us plan, understand where we're at, and survive. But... It's not all there is. You need to start thinking in terms of living as if each day is the first day of your life. This is, a, this is the only way you can then conceive a plan for all you wish for. And if you didn't hear it through all my stuttering, you can rewind. <laughs> all right, you guys. That's all I got for you today. This book is called The Wish by Angela Donovan. I'm pretty sure they have it on Amazon or your lo local library or whatever. Um, be sure to pick it up and to read it. And I'm going to probably do a couple of more 
passages from different chapters of this book, along with other books. I'm not going to just read one chapter or one passage from each book. I'm going to go back to the same books and take different lessons that I feel like are, you know, educational and then do vlogs about them. All right, you guys, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and always see you soon.